Kieran, thank you for talking to us this morning. And it is a quick turnaround from Wednesday night's win. Uh, I'm sure there are a few tired legs after the game, but hopefully everyone came through unscathed. Yeah, we think so. Of course, we're still um, you know, not even 48 hours yet, so we're still recovering. and We'll do a, a light session today and get ready to go again. But no, we, um, we seem to come through the game with no problems. Of course, everyone in good spirits and looking forward to the next game. Is it one of those where you've had to balance you know, full-on preparation for, Swans for the Swansea game, but also balancing you know, that you lose 24 hours with it being a Wednesday night game, don't you? Yeah, of course, yeah. So, yeah, there's not much time on the grass. You know, preparation be done in a different way, but we've, we've had plenty of experience for that. So, um, no, we, we'll be ready for the game come 3 o'clock on Saturday. We know it's going to take a, a big effort, a big physical effort. We're going to have to perform really well. But, um, you know, it's, it's a game to look forward to. This busy spells of the season where the games come thick and fast is, is something that we relish. Wednesday night, we saw Amari play down the middle. Uh, what does he bring to that role? Yeah, look, I think it's a um, really good asset to have in the squad of, you know, quite a few of our forward players can play in different roles. Omari, definitely, you know, Marcus Harness played so many different roles. So we've been here. Um, Connor and Nathan both played as strikers earlier in the career and I play a little bit, you know, withdrawn. Jeremy's come in, he can play anywhere across the front line. So it's great to have them different attributes because the boys have all got different, you know, different qualities they can bring to each role. Of course, Omari's more of a... You know, more of a dribbler, more of a ball carrier than, than some of our other forwards. Um, and, and he brings his qualities to, to whichever role we put him in. And, uh, you know, that's great, you know, options to have. And it's up to us then to, to try and choose the right games to utilise the different things we have in the squad. It's another long one. And what are your thoughts on Swansea? Yeah, it's going to be a good game. Um, of course, Luke hasn't been there for for too long. Mm -hmm. But, um, you know, you can, you can see exactly what he's trying to do. They're going to try and be a really... A really positive and um, you know aggressive team on and off the ball, and uh, of course they've you know got a, a good tradition as a football club as well of, of playing good football. So um, I think it should make for a really good game. It's a good pitch, nice stadium. Um, we'll go there looking to impose ourselves in the game for sure. They'll do the same, and uh, it should make for a really good contest. When a team is in that phase of kind of look like you say they're looking at what they're trying to do, does that make them slightly unpredictable? I think in this, um, you know, I think in football you can never be certain anyway. Of mm. course, you can you can watch the last team's games, but there can, there's always variation. Millwall set up a little bit differently than what they had done in the previous games and what we expected, and and many teams do. The, the better that your team's doing as well, of course, the more likely it is that some teams will tweak things against you. So, no, it's it's clear, you know, the essence of the team that Swansea want to be from you know the history of the coach and and the traditions of that club, mm. uh, but the details within that, you know. You always have to be ready for you know variability within that, and um, you know that's why it's important to to work with a group over a good period of time to be ready for all the different tactical variations the game can present, and um, you know deal with what comes on the day. Yes, it's a long way to go, as we've said, but this is another one of those games that everyone should be looking forward to, isn't it? You know, got into the championship for a reason, and we're enjoying these away games. They're big big occasions for the club. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Um, yeah, really good night the other night. The supporters were fantastic. And, and as you say, you know, um, Swansea have been a, a good championship team and a good Premier League team, you know, and, and not that many years ago. So, you know, a great challenge for us. Um, the type of game that you should look forward to going to, you know, again, good stadium, good pitch against a good team and um, going there in good form and trying to impose ourselves. And uh, yeah, it's, it's one that hopefully the supporters can enjoy and um, all the more so if we can get a performance and a result.